Okay, we're now recording. Um, so Junior says he's still working on it. Um, but I think that's great progress. And I hope the tutors give you some good insights. I will fix with the help of my peers and tutors. Okay, I think Abraham has already uh, got his DVC working. So maybe you can talk to him and then he can guide you through it. Thanks for sharing, Junior, and all the best. Um, anyone else wants to go next? So from the list, we have Hafton. Hafton, do you want to share your progress and what you got done yesterday, what you're planning today? OK. Uh, hello, everyone. So overall, uh, I'm progressing well on the challenge and uh, I have finalized uh, task one and task two. So uh, I will continue working on the AB hypothesis uh, testing and uh, statical modeling. Um, that's great progress. Did you get your DVC running? Yeah, it's working. Okay, so really you have two options to, of people you can ask. Um, thanks for sharing, Haftam. Um, we can go to Asefa, Rubel. Do you want to share your progress and your plans for today and any blockers? Asafa, can you can you hear us? If you're going to type it on the chat, um, just leave a reaction like a thumbs up while we wait. Okay. And probably not with us. Um, Matiwas, good morning. Do you want to share your progress? Okay. Um, Matiwas has done both task one and task two. Got some challenge in pushing the work after DVC, but finally did it. I lost my comment because I have changed my repos so many times i believe you will consider it today i plan to work on my report um okay so it seems the only challenge you're getting is pushing your work after dbc but you did it um so are, are you are you getting any blockers currently or are you good Yes, good. Okay, that's great. Um, all the best with your report. Uh, yeah, Dasa said he's doing data cleaning on EDA. And how's that going for you, yeah, Dasa? And if if you can, let's try and be more specific in. Um, Cleaning and EDA. Okay. Mm. So, um, are you having any blockers or any challenges cleaning or doing EDA? Or are you good? Yeah, that's a, do you need any help um, with doing EDA or cleaning data? Yeah, good for now. Okay. Um, just remember, submissions is today. And if you're experiencing any challenges, please ask your colleagues who are already um, 
who've already progressed to other tasks. Um, so we have Tibebu. Do you want to share your progress? What you did yesterday, if you got any blockers? Um, what, what are you planning to do today? Tibibu, can you hear us? Okay, yeah, she, she said she started the challenge yesterday. It's going well. So far, she has created the repo and DVC. Today, I'll be working on EDA and finalizing her task. Okay. Um, that's, that's good that you've created your repo. Is your DVC working? Yes, it's working. Okay, that's great. And today you'll be doing EDA and finalize the task. Um, since we've heard from everyone and we're just 16 minutes into the session, does anyone want to just share with us their code, how they approached um, writing their code and doing task one and task two? Just anyone? Others will also learn from it. Um, I think it, it will be nice for someone to just follow through. Anyone willing? Shamilis, you made progress. Do you want to show us a bit of your code and how you how you did your EDA just for anyone struggling to? OK, so can I share my screen? Yes, please. Okay, okay. All right. Um, while Abraham shares his screen, and uh, Nadia, welcome to the uh stand up if you can please update us on what you tried to do yesterday and your goals for today and if you and if you faced any blockers you can feel free to just leave it in the chat so can you can you guys uh, see my screen yes we can Okay, uh, so this is uh, the, my, my, my project folder structure. Uh, I, uh, I'm trying to use uh, the object uh, oriented uh, style to, to, to write uh, my, my code. So as uh, you guys here uh, can see here, I, I write some of uh, data quality checking functions here. Uh, these are my 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 functions i use them to uh, to check uh, the quality of my data and here are my fu my functions uh, to do and some uh, just for someone who's struggling to go through the to write the code especially i saw someone still doing the cleaning if it's if it's okay with you you can just explain what each line, not each line of code does, but what, what, yeah, what, what your code does, uh, yeah, that would be helpful to some. Uh, okay, uh, for for the for the cleaning part, I uh, I I didn't do uh, uh, data cleaning for this uh, for this project yet uh, because. Uh, I want to analyze the data before before cleaning up uh, before cleaning it up, just to to understand the the true the true nature of the the data, uh, because after after doing the cleaning, uh, uh, 
uh, you know, some uh, some assumption will be taken into account and the data will be changed. So, uh, just before doing that, I want to I want to do some basic uh, descriptive anal analysis. So I didn't uh, do data cleaning for this, but. Uh, what uh, what I will do to do the, the data cleaning uh, will be just separate uh, the numerical and uh, categorical uh, data. After I separated them, for example, uh, as, as you see here, uh, you can separate uh, categorical data using here. Uh, this, this, uh, this code can uh, separate only categorical uh, data from the from the data set and you can separate uh, numerical uh, columns using the code here. Uh, after you do that, uh, the, there are, uh, 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 for example, two approach, uh, different approach to, to clean uh, the data based on the data type. For example, for the categorical uh, columns, you may want to use uh, 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 most most frequent uh, mode mode of that column that means you can uh, fill uh, the input uh, the input um, the input values with uh, most frequent value on that uh, on that column for for categorical uh, uh, columns and for the numeric numerical columns you can fill the input values using uh, by calculating the mean, the mean of uh, that, the mean value of that column, you can you can feel that. I uh, usually use uh, this these two approach. Is that okay. uh, is that okay? Yeah, yeah, that's much more comprehensive. Thanks. And just for anyone who who sees something that they haven't done yet and wants to ask a question, please feel free to ask them. But yeah, you can continue. Thanks. Uh, so should I keep uh, explaining or uh, is it enough? Uh, yeah, I think that's enough. Maybe if you have another code or maybe how you did DVC, just anything that you found interesting that you'd like to share with the team to the next. Yeah, for the for the uh, DVC part, uh, yeah, I, I, I think, uh, yeah, some, some uh, people are having trouble with that. So for the for the DVC part, I use uh, my my local storage uh, to as a, as a remote uh, location to store the files, uh, and, uh, and there are some some codes I I used uh, to to set it up, but I wrote those on the terminal, so I I I couldn't uh, able to share them uh, RAM, but I will share it on Slack. Yeah. I will, I will share them uh, on Slack. Okay, um, that's great. Um, anything else you want to share regarding the project? Uh, maybe uh, the thing I was explaining about the, the object oriented design uh, yes. here, after I was explaining that, uh, after you you write your function, then I use I use them in my notebook or anywhere, uh, just by by importing them like this. So this will make your uh, your code uh, more cleaner, and you don't have to uh, uh, write uh, repetitive uh, code. Uh, so this this will uh, save you a, a lot of uh, time, and it's uh, a best. Uh, a best practice. So the, this is it from my side. Thank you. Um, thank you very much for sharing your progress. I I hope some of you got uh, something or learned something from him. Um, so thanks, Abraham. That's really great. Uh, Nadia says she was able to do some tasks some had to work but some are still figuring out today um can you be more specific on what tasks you were able to do and the ones that you're still figuring out today and if you need some help oh 
or a better question would be um have you have you completed task one or are you still working on that Nadia? Okay, I, I don't think she can hear us. Yes. Uh, but anyone else have anything to ask? Anything unclear before we close the stand up? We have four minutes. Okay, so I'll take that as everything is clear and you're ready for your submissions today. So, yeah, I think the only announcement is we have our submissions today and I wish you all the best in your submissions. Have a great day. Okay, Million. Even if you're speaking, you're on mute. Uh, good morning, everyone. I just have one announcement. Uh, on Friday, we're going to have a hot seat with Arun. I will share this on Slack. So it's going to be a combined uh, hot seat. It's going to be on time of CBS. So a hot seat is where we get one person on a hot seat, as you can hear it. Then we ask questions. So uh this win this one is going to be with arun of course we'll be asking like every question like any question that you'll be having even personal questions uh won't be doing this uh friday 10 a.m utc that means it's uh i think one is african time so that's uh, as announcement i will also pass it tomorrow so i would love everyone to plan for this don't don't really, really plan to, to miss this one it's going to be amazing uh hot seat with the room you can ask every question we'll be having uh people from um with, uh other programs uh other trainees from other different programs we'll be having you to j we'll be having cohort b if i'm not wrong yeah so we're gonna have fun we're gonna be a lot of people so let's be there for this one thank you Um, thanks, Emily, and that sounds like fun, and I hope we will all join and ask questions. So enjoy your day, everyone, and all the best with your submissions. Bye.